Hello and welcome to another edition of Popping the Tin. And today we got a, a big tin to pop. Big one. Look at this thing. I think I need a can opener. <laughs> Blackthorn Shillelagh. And I actually looked up that word to learn how to say it because, uh, yeah, I never heard it before. But, Me neither. But you know what a Blackthorn Shillelagh is? I would like to know what a Shillelagh is. He's holding it, actually. So it's, 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 it can be used to, to, hit, to hit you upside the head. <laughs> it's made out of Blackthorn, which I'm guessing, you know, it's, it's, a, it's a tree, right? Uh -huh. And it has like a little knot okay, on the them, top. Okay, show them so they see that. I'm going to put a picture of some actually in the real okay. world, but you know. So, so I, that's a Shillelagh. Yeah, Blackthorn, yeah, made out of Blackthorn. And you you could be used as a walking stick or if it's shorter too, as so that, a weapon. But that's in Ireland, right? Yeah, that's in Ireland. Let me say okay. it's an Irish word. So, um, as usual, we're gonna pop the tin and let's see what this is all about. Um, I was I was happy to see that it's gonna sell between twenty some and thirty. It's a big tin, which is eight ounces. Where the other one, remember how we were kind of talking bad about one that was sold for I think it was forty or something. So they're getting the prices right. I think this is this is more. Yeah, they have. Um, they, you get more for. Uh, more, more, more stuff. Oh yeah, more. definitely. Yeah. Usually the, the... It is actually, it looks like a, uh, the smaller version or the smaller can uh -huh. uh, for coffee. Have you seen those? Oh, That's yes, about yes. the size. Yes, you know? yes. Yeah, no, this, this is plenty. Okay, so go ahead and pop the tin. That's what we're going right. to do first and I'll let you read about it after. Hopefully it's... It, it's going to be an easy one. Is it an easy one? Oh, yeah. thank goodness. Yeah, it's going to be an easy one. All right. Well, We've been having lots of those lately. Close. Yeah, thank God. Oh, I'm supposed to do it right here. Away. Oh, it doesn't have a little. The little um, yeah. cardboard. A little cardboard. Yeah. Well, it's to the rim. Yeah. Show them. Show them what it looks like okay. there. There you go. All right. So let's read what does it have, and I'll start pouring some here to get All the right. pipe ready. Actually, you usually ask me what it smells like. Oh. <laughs> yes. I, Pumpkin mm -hmm. spice to me. Really? Pumpkin spice. Well, you know what I'm smelling? I'm not gonna tell you. See if you really? smell something else. I'll sm I smell something particular there. Probably pumpkin spice and maybe uh, plums or raisins or okay. something like that. All right. I smell uh, alcohol. Well, yeah, that's it. Yeah, and actually, it smells good. It is, yeah. Yeah, that's, that's a good Absolutely. smell. Now that I say it, try is to it? smell it again and see if you, of course, now I well, it is trick your brain. Yeah. Oh, you know what? You remember that that cake that we, that we oh, had yeah. the whiskey? Was it whiskey? It was a bourbon, bourbon cake. Bourbon cake. Yeah. Mm -hmm. That's yeah. Mm -hmm. Most of that. All right. Yeah. I'll, I'll, I'll pour it in here. Yeah. All right. Go ahead and read. What's what's it all about? Okay. So this is the world's finest Virginias, Burleys, and Black Cavendish. Art is this art artfully blended with just the right amount of Irish whiskey to transform any Irishman into their best self. Normally, we will encourage you to sit back, light your pipe and relax. In this case, stand up, light your pipe and go find some mischief. All right. So this is actually something early that's gonna come out February 6th at, uh, no. Is it? Yeah, February 6th at 6 p.m. Um, six so, six so there's two coming out at the same day at the same time one from Sutliff and one from Corner and Deal maybe they're maybe they're competing Come there see, maybe yeah. perhaps um, moisture is about uh, you can say modest or damp you see how it sticks together uh, but it's beautiful you can see that there's all three there uh, Burley Cavendish and Virginia Cavendish the dark leaves, barely the ones that are brown, and then the Virginias are the, the more clear leaves. Yeah, touch it a little bit and tell me what you think. No, just looking at it, you can see there's there's some moisture. I'm gonna use my yeah, beautiful flat cap pipe that I got custom made from Mr. Glenn Tinsky. Beautiful, he did a great job. I kind of let him go with it and uh and I told him. Pretty much, you know what I liked, and and he, and he made he made it happen. He made it happen. Well, actually, I have not felt I have not felt something that moist in quite some time. Okay, okay, yeah. Most of the ones that we have, lady, have it's been, been very, very dry I, or almost no. Uh, yeah. Is it humidity? 
moisture yet. Yeah. So we're gonna we're gonna we're gonna light it like this. Of course, I suggest something that's uh, this moist for you guys to dry it out a little bit if you don't want to have to deal with relighting the pipe a hundred times. Yeah. Sometimes they do very well. I mean, sometimes they, you know they surprise us sometimes where we think it's not gonna light up, but it does. It does. Yeah. This one, I think you, you I, may need to air it for the. I bit. think we're gonna struggle with this one for sure, but. Let's just do it for the sake of time. I'm gonna push it in there. Oh, and today I, my allergies are terrible. I've been sneezing so here, so you can do yours. All right. Uh, okay, let me find my thing. What am I? What am I smoking here? You always tell me. Oh, that's my one of my favorite. This is short. Like, I usually like the long stuff. Yeah, but this is is filtered, so that's oh, why that's I picked that one for you. Uh huh. Wait, it's green. All right. What he didn't want you to know is that he sneezed yeah. and about blew up a lung. <laughs> I had to stop the video because <laughs> I got into a sneeze. You thought that I was not gonna tell him, did no, you? No, no. I, I, I actually, I actually knew you were gonna tell him for a fact, but I didn't want them to, to. I don't want to blow up their ears with my look. <laughs> loud sneeze. I tell you, it is loud. Oh. Second light here, um, you know, I knew it was gonna be a little difficult to light up, but tell us about the room note. Well, did you just light it up. Wants <laughs> 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 me to hurry up. A sneeze and a light up. That's that's all we have so far. <laughs> Not much to go on. Just, I can with you. I really can't. Tell me what you think. Tell me what you think. Oh, I don't know much right now. <laughs> All right. Let's see. See, smoke it a little bit. A little <laughs> and I'll tell you. <laughs> <laughs> I think that sneeze just threw me off. <laughs> he sure did. He got you on fast forward. <laughs> I know. <laughs> oh, you guys see what I have to do. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, so... Oh, now I can smell it. Yeah. Even I'm still smelling a little bit. Oh, wow. This is really good. I would say scent. Mm -hmm. Very flushable to the, not the palate, but to your, to your whiffer. There yeah. you go. So this it may be good. a family and friends. Yes. Is it one of those yeah. that you smoke Inside in? Inside or outside. It's, very, it's actually not very smoky. It doesn't have that much. Smoke coming out of it. Well, it may be a good thing. Yeah, well, let's take hate, of course. Yeah. Are you smoking? struggling? Are you trying to kind of keep it going? Or? Yeah, yeah, because it, 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 it was moist. Yeah. yeah, it was, yeah, well. But not too bad. I mean, some you really have to struggle. So this is just. Uh, yeah, and sometimes I hate when you're struggling with it because then you just don't want to do it anymore because you feel like you. Well, or, or you get it too hot. Yeah, you get it exactly. Then you get irritated. You know, All right. Like, yeah. So, family and fur, please, sir, do you smell any particular things in the air? Any peach racings? Uh, anything? No, other than it, 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 was, it smells good. But I do not smell. I When you laid it up, I was expecting to hit some of those tones that they were talking about. and. And I, I don't get it, but it's, it smells good. Pleasant. Yeah, it's very pleasant. All right. All right, your turn. Okay. So before the sneeze, we were saying that it's a Savioli pipe. It, it has that green yeah. on it. And it's filter. It's actually a six millimeter filter on that one. It's a smaller filter. And I, I keep hitting you. Mm -hmm. Are we too close? Mm -hmm. That's not a problem, <laughs> So, of course, I'm on purpose. I'm trying to keep it lit, but it's not doing too bad. It's certainly for being a, a wet. I, I say wet. Really, it's not. It's not. I was. It's more damp.
Maybe I have some. So, I'm, I'm, have I'm, some. Try, I'm trying to nurture that fire. <laughs> it's kind of hard. Maybe I should have some Irish music in the background. Yeah. I'll try to find some, maybe. We should have wore, wore green. I have some green. You do? Yeah. Oh, I don't. It's okay. This is on St. Patrick's Day. So, obviously, you know, this is meant to be a St. Patrick's Day blend that they coming out now in February. So that, mm -hmm. so if you're you ready. like it, if you like it, exactly, you'll be ready. And definitely with this big, good Lord, eight ounce things, you, you have plenty to share and, and do a party, you know. Have a St. Patrick's Day pipe smoking party for sure with this. Yeah, that sounds good. Yeah. I mean, if we would have been in California, I would have done that. Mm -hmm. So, so far, very easy smoke, uh, pleasant, just a little bit subtle, subtle um, sweetness in there, but not, it doesn't feel artificial, it feels just natural, it smells good, the, the room note is good. So far, no bite or or bad aftertaste. The retro hail is pleasant. Actually, mm -hmm. sometimes, guys, if you want to get the flavor of the... This is for the new pipe smokers. If you want to get the flavor of the tobacco, you do a retro hail. And you, because you are involved in more senses in it, um, you, you get the flavor. Um, that's how the brain works. So you do a, a quick retro hail through the nose and and you uh you pick up more flavors. I am so desperate for it to just light up light up and continue. Do you tamp it good? I have okay. tried. I mean, yeah, my my lord. How's it going? I'm very impressed. After that third light, I'm gonna tap it, but almost it doesn't even Hopefully. need that much. So while we do this, just wanna see if there's any interest. Uh, um, a week after that, uh, they're gonna be coming up with Pi Force episode one. If, it's you a chameleon. Guys, if you guys are interested in us reviewing that one, let us know in the comments below. If there's not a lot of interest, we won't. But that one is coming. Let's see. Paper says here, it on February 13th, so day before Valentine's. So if there's interest, we'll review this one next for you guys. Okay. Episode one. They did like the movies where they did episode four five and six, and then they went back to one, two, and three. That's how they did this. Uh, they oh. came up. Like, like the Star Wars movies that they started in the middle. Yeah. And they went back, yeah. But instead of a Star Wars character, they put a chameleon. Yeah, well, frog, yeah, because if not, they will have to pay royalties oh, to Star yeah. Wars, obviously. Oh, thank yeah. thank you. Yeah, no, no. No need. So they just keep putting some weird looking animals, but cool looking animals. Yeah. We have some of the other ones there, signed, signed by Mr. Bert Jensen. All right, so what, you struggle? No, no, I, uh, I got it, I got okay. it. Okay, I was gonna, we were gonna do the switcheroo if you wanted to. I'm gonna do the water room. <laughs> so yours is filter. This one is not. Here, try mine a little bit and see. Mine has lipstick. So Your has I'm lipstick. Sorry. That's okay. A lot of my pies now have lipstick. No problem. <laughs> Don't buy any more uh, pipes that have that little plastic thing at the end. Oh, that, they, they're always red. They don't come with that. I, they don't come with no, that. No, I had that. You did? Yeah, I have, I have little ones that I put on some pipes. Oh, okay. you you're, put it, you're allergic to me? No. <laughs> No, you put it there if you if you know you're gonna clench a lot the pipe so that you ah. you don't get all your tooth marks on here and so yeah. And yeah, and you don't get lipstick and stuff. 
no, that wasn't the point of it. But yeah, and you know, I'm not using them as much as I used to. So as you can see, I, I have a bunch of them and I'm not really putting them. So I don't know. It is good on this one as well, but it went out. No big it's, difference. It's like I got to start talking. No, actually. Both of them. I didn't even have to light yours. No, mine was it's going. going. It was going. Yeah, yours kind of went out. This is, again, uh, I, I think I've said this before, but this uh, 325, so the Arthur shape, especially the 7 LE ones that I had the experience with, um, they are great, great smokers, guys. We have a bunch of these, especially for aromatics because it has the thick walls. They smoke great. They, they keep it going. Um, I love them. So in aromatics, you prefer to have a, a big thick, wall? Thick wall, thick yeah, wall. because, okay. again, it, you know, it hits because okay, it heats up not. if the wall is thin you're gonna feel that hotness but this as you can see look i mean there's nothing there but you, yours is going awesome i mean keep yours up yours, yours, is, yours is dead you kill mine i guess you were talking and then when i got it up it was gone okay oh i'll fix it up so wow what an easy smoke um you know, I was about to say, you know, it's like a very sit back and relax for real. They they say stand up, but I'm yeah. like, I don't feel like it. Mm -mm. I feel like just sitting right here and doing this. Yeah. This could be an all day smoke. Uh, smokes that are these that are very easy. Mm -hmm. Listen, they're not very harsh or have rough edges. I say, I call them the all day smokes. Yeah, you don't have that, like, the other day we were reviewing one and it was very difficult to keep smoking it smoking it because you the palate has this bad yeah sometimes they have an artificial a, yeah, something that, that, that flavor that is yeah. just like i don't want to have that in my mouth really. not this one very good very not good. at all in in my experience i don't know like everybody's palate is different and ph in the tongue is different the ones that usually are blended with some kind of alcohol. Uh, this one says Irish whiskey. Is that yes. what this one said? Um, I don't know. They do really well for me. I, I usually um, can smoke them for a long time and enjoy them. You know, just like that that uh, bourbon barrel plum pudding. And uh, I love I love those types. The, the last one that we reviewed was apple barrel plum pudding. And it was a good one. It was a winner. And this thing puts you at ease. Another winner. I'm very relaxed. Maybe they put something in here. <laughs> they just put you at ease. I know. They put something else. <laughs> they put some other junk in here. They didn't put it in there. Wow. I can't say nothing negative about this. This is great. Nope. You know, I'm trying to find something, but. And I've you, been you puffing can, it hard. You cannot even say something bad about the price because I think it's a good price. Yeah, for yeah, all that. yeah. I think they, they, uh, they're, they're now kind of getting the happy medium there. Mm -hmm. When I tell you, whoever blended this, they did a good job. They absolutely nailed it with how much of this they put, how much of that they put. Don't change the formula. Yeah. Keep it the way it is. It's perfect. Very well balanced. Very perfect. Well. Flavors are perfect. Oh, yeah. so I, I'm ready. And I'm picky. Yeah, we, we are picky. And I'll tell you the truth. I hate it. I We're hate picky it. with the artificial flavors, but this. All right. Ready? Ready. One, two, three. Two thumbs up. They're for surprised. This one. They're surprised. They're shocked. Like, oh, yeah. not really. <laughs> yeah, we gave two thumbs down to you know one of the last ones. Yeah. Not the last one, but yeah, no. All right, so I'm gonna go first. Go ahead. Out of five, I'm gonna give it four point five. I'm really impressed. I I I was expecting actually a lot less. Uh but no, easy smoke. Uh the flavors are there good. The room note is there is good. Uh, even though it was uh, moist, damp, it lights up and stays yeah. lit. Mm -hmm. uh, 
the nice. combination. I think I just think they just do good percentages and and uh, came out of where uh, the, the the tin art is is cool. I I really I'm really impressed. Uh, how about you? Well, I would say the price is right. The amount that you get is right. Uh, the artist is nice, although that's besides the point. Um, so I love the smell. The balance is on point. They did an excellent, excellent job with that because there's no bad taste. There's no, um, when I did also the retro help, nothing. Nothing that I can say that is negative. I will give it a 4.75. Uh, wow. Almost there, perfect. One of your highest I, rating. Yeah, yeah. I, yeah, it is. It is actually is. That's how much I like it. I suggest you get this right away because as soon as the word goes out, you may not even make it <laughs> to the St. Patrick thing. You might not out. I don't know if it was the maple shadows, but because uh, uh, that one we gave good scores, and actually that one was mm -hmm. gone pretty fast. But yeah, mm -hmm. uh, no, uh, this is a winner. This is a winner for yeah. sure. All the way, all the way. And he says, "Has uh, Virginia Burley Black Cavendish, and they also added the Irish whiskey. They might have added a little bit of extra something, something we don't know, and they didn't put it down. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> but it, whatever they did." It is awesome, and if they say uh, for relaxing, it is, it is, it is. It doesn't make you, you just want, you want to continue smoking it, which is the point. Well, yeah. If you put it down and you don't, that's not good. And also to me, the ones that I give high rating is the ones that I know that after I tried it or we do the review or I tried it for the first time, I'm already looking forward to trying it again. Like mm -hmm. this is one that, I, you know what? When and that's I, gonna be up on your rotation. Yeah, when I sit down, I, I'm, I'm gonna put this. So yeah, this is going on my rotation. So another good sign. Um, wow, I didn't expect it. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'll, I'll Bravo be to whoever made I'll it. I'll be honest with you. I don't want to put it down. Mm -hmm. uh, we don't want to even finish. Okay, so I'm not gonna put it down. I'm just gonna <laughs> keep it in my mouth. I'll let <laughs> you say all the goodbye. So oh, again, let us know if you want us to review Pipe Force uh, episode one. If not, I have some others that. We can review this one is not coming out until february 13. uh the one that we actually review is coming out february 6 at 6 p.m and uh there is uh the other one we review is also coming out the same day so february 6 on the lookout there's some there's some uh, some good ones coming out oh well, yeah mbsd pipes uh is our sponsor and uh i'm gonna leave a link i always do if you're looking for new pipes, state pipes that do a great job, or Meerschaum pipes, um, their prices are, are excellent. Uh, one day, I, I think I want to do a video and kind of show you on their website so you can see that I'm not just saying it. <laughs> They're actually, the price are actually good, and, and that's why I bought some pipes from them. It's a, uh, it's a couple. It's just a small business very personal and they're based out of Atlanta, Georgia. So right here in the United States. So all those things are, are, are great uh, to me, you know, to, to buy from from here. To and us. yeah, to so, us all. yeah. So again, if you want to uh, sponsor them and sponsor us, just click on the link and uh, get your pipe. Uh, that's one it more, for me. One more hit. No, I actually was going to ask you, oh. where is the, um, where is the, uh, the raffle? Going to end. Oh, yeah. You mentioned that on your previous yeah. On the previous video, video, we mentioned about uh, the Janos Coquinos uh, raffle because he um, his place got broken into and and everything stolen. About sixteen thousand dollars worth of all his pipes got stolen, uh, the equipment, you name it. I mean, and so uh, the the raffle is February twenty fifth, I think. Um, go on Facebook. Um, you you know if you look at the pipe divas they have something there you go to his website and uh, there's something there or if you can't find anything just send me an email blackoutpiper at aol.com and i'll put you in contact somehow if you want to either help him out or be part of the raffle it's 25 dollars for a pipe of his and a bunch of other stuff that people have donated so of course if you win it's a great deal if not you're just contributing to to help him out great cause yeah what they want is to send him some money because obviously, you know, he's a, he's a great guy. If you ever meet him, you know what I mean. 
smile on his face. Um, he's a great uh, pipe. I mean, all his pipes are just amazing. I'll try to maybe put some here so you guys can see. <laughs> They're just out of this world. And uh, anyway, you know how we are. We're a community that likes to help out each other. So uh, I'll, I'll put something there. And contact me if you want to help in any way, shape, or form. Also, we would like to uh, thank uh, Jake, Java Jake Coffee, yes. uh, for sending us some coffee. So we're going to have to, somebody has to do a review for our office. I know. He, he, I, I'm trying to see to, the problem is that here, we're not allowed to even smoke in the first place. And, and a cigar, I think that's going to create some attention. But, yeah. mm -hmm. but uh, Jake, um, uh, let but me. if it is, if it has to do with drinking the coffee, and tasting the coffee and, and letting them know we can we can we can certainly do that that's easier so he had an idea of pairing a cigar with a coffee and uh he 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 sent this cigar and i think it's gonna pair awesome so i have to do a video maybe on the outside uh his cost face if you haven't tried it let me tell you man this guy does a great job and Calvin. he's very knowledgeable and he's super nice you know we met him there personally in in california let's see the website is there there you go a plug-in for java jakes what did you send me there? I don't have my glasses. This is Colombia Enza Veredas Vecina. Yeah, he knows. It is dark. He knows his coffee and he blends. Uh, and if you want a specific way, if you want it dark, if you want it light, if you want it this or that, uh, he can cost, you know, custom uh, send you the coffee according to what type of coffee you like. I love the packaging. I know. <laughs> Such a super <laughs> nice guy. So, hey, Java J is another great person Thank that you. we will, we will love for you guys to sponsor, all right? So, hey, I think we- That's it, I think we upset. remembered everything, maybe. I know, you, you're, you're doing better than me. You, <laughs> you, be, okay. you becoming a pro hey, at this. Honey, <laughs> you taught me everything I know. <laughs> so guys, we'd like to thank you for spending this time with us. Uh, we'll, we'll see you soon, hopefully. Yep. Mm -hmm. And uh, we would like to thank you Give us thumbs up if you like content and subscribe please yeah click that bell if you want to be notified when our videos are coming up that way you know what is the latest and greatest uh tobacco we try to review things that are coming in the future so you can have an idea what it is make a decision whether it's something for you or not we give you a little bit of facts a little bit of our opinion and hopefully that's enough for you guys to to decide and i spend money on this or i spend money on this other one yeah. One thing that I wanted to add is that this one doesn't have a very high content nicotine. Exactly. Sorry. It, sorry, it is yeah. very simple. It is, it is not that strong. Mm -hmm. So if, if you're looking for that big punch, that one is not going to have it. It's just our palette. I am more, it pairs with my, uh, my palette, my personality. Mm -hmm. And I really love it. But if you're looking for a very strong tobacco, this is not that. Mm -hmm. This is a more mellow, relaxed, chill. You can smoke it from the beginning to end. Um, Low nicotine yeah, on this it, one. It is so not, it's not hot. Completely opposed to some of the ones I reviewed earlier yeah. this week. Where I, would, I would say it's a little high. below medium. Yeah, this is on the mild yeah. side. Yeah, so there you have two ends of the spectrum in, the, in our last reviews there for you to choose. But if you want to pump it up, just add some of what we had the other day. And yeah, you add have some, a big hit. Add some dark park and talk <laughs> you to that you and for sure. <laughs> Okay, y'all, that's all from now, from us right now. So we'll see you next time. Y'all stay lit. All right, bye. Bye.